right, so one skill that's extremely useful when you're working with dogs in many different settings is to be able to get them safely in and out of kennels. One of the first things that you're gonna do is you get a slip lead, get it open nice and wide so that you're gonna be able to get it over the dog's head easily. These are great leads for shelter and kennel environments because of how easy it is to get the dog in and out with them. When I get up to the kennel, I'm going to first always put my foot right in front of the kennel door. So you allow the door to open just enough into your foot that you can get your hand in there and get that leash over their head. Once you've got that, you can slide it down, get it nice and secure, and then allow the dog to come out as you pull your foot away, but just keep your, your control hand, I call this the control hand that you slide down the leash, keep it short so when the dog comes out, they're not running down the aisle and getting you know five feet away from you. You can keep them under control and close to you. All right, so let's see how that looks with Jake. He's super excited to come out. I've got plenty of room with my slip lead. First step, first step is always gonna be first step with the foot. I wanna make sure that this door can't swing out enough to hit me in the face, because you can see he's gonna hit it right away. There it is. I'm also keeping it that way so he can't slide out, but I can get my hand in. Take your time with this, there's no rush. Okay, again, this is why the foot on the door is so important. Now he's out. Even though he was able to stick his head out, he wasn't able to escape and just go running free around the courtyard here. My foot being there was able to keep him in place so I could get the leash on him. And now I'll say hi to him. What's up, buddy? What's up, good boy? And he's much calmer now that he's gotten a, a little attention and love. He just couldn't wait to get out.